CIETNCERT presents audio book of EVS for class 5 entitled Looking Around 5. This is lesson 4. Mangoes round the year from page 35 to page 41. Let's listen to lesson 4. Page 35. Mangoes round the year. This page has two pictures. In the first picture, three children are talking to each other with their lunch boxes in their hands. Neetu says, "Wow, Aman's lunch box has sweet puris." Aman says, "Hey, today Neetu has brought potato sabzi." Preeti says, "I have got bhindi." In the second picture, again, those three children continue talking. Aman says, "Oh, Neetu, I think your potato sabzi is spoiled." Preeti replies, "Don't eat that. You may fall sick. Here, you take some bindi." Discuss. A. How did Aman know that the potato sabzi has got spoiled? B. Have you ever seen some food that has got spoiled? How did you know that it was spoiled? C. Preeti told Neetu not to eat the potato sabzi. What would have happened if she had eaten it? Teacher's note: Let children give examples of food spoilage based on their own experiences. It is important to explain the difference between food spoilage and wastage of food. The experiment with bread can be started when you begin the lesson. because it will need to continue over 6 days at least page 36 right look into your kitchen and write down names of food items that a can get spoiled in 2 to 3 days dash 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 b can be kept for a week dash 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 c would not spoil till one month dash 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 look at your friends list and discuss in the class will your list be the same in all seasons what would change when food gets spoiled in your house what do you do with it bg returned the bread there is a picture of an unopened packet of bread here with patches of fungus in it Aman's BG went to the market to buy bread. The shop was very crowded. The shopkeeper picked up a packet of bread and gave it to BG. She looked at it and returned it immediately. Study the picture of the bread packet here and guess why BG returned it. How did she find that the bread had got spoiled? Find out. Look carefully at 2 3 packets of food items. A. What can we know from what is written on the packet? B. When you buy anything from the market, what do you look for on the packet? Teachers note. Help children to read and note the information on the packets regarding weight, date of packing, etc. While doing the experiment, precautions need to be taken depending on the weather conditions. that is the bread should not be allowed to dry up there should be some ventilation in the room do put up the chart in the classroom and remind the children to fill it in every day page 37 how does food get spoiled the whole class can do this experiment together take a piece of bread or roti sprinkle a few drops of water on it and put it in a box close the box see the bread or roti every day until you find some changes on it make a table on a chart paper and put it up in the classroom fill up the chart every day after discussing the changes seen there is a table shown here which has five columns with a heading changes in the bread or roti first column is of day second column is of by touch Third column is of by smell. Fourth by looking through hand lens and fifth 
by color. Fill in your observations in the table for 6 days under the given headings. Find out the reason for these changes. From where did the fungus come on the bread? Different kinds of food items spoil due to different reasons. Some foods spoil soon. Some stay good for long. List some seasons and conditions in which food spoils quickly. Teachers note, whenever children do this experiment, they should wash their hands after the experiment. Page 38 Given below are some food items and some simple methods by which these could be kept fresh for one to two days. Match the correct pairs. Food items 1. Milk 2. Cooked rice 3. Green coriander that is dhania 4. Onion, garlic Methods 1. Put in a bowl and keep the bowl in a container with some water. 2. Wrap in a damp cloth. 3. Boil it. 4. Keep it in a dry open place. Summer Treat Mamidi Tandra Chitti Babu and Chinna Babu live in Atreyapuram town in Andhra Pradesh. The brothers spend the summer holidays playing in the mango garden when the trees are full of fruits. They also like to eat unripe mangoes with salt and chilli powder. At home, their mother cooks unripe mangoes in different ways. She also makes many kinds of mango pickles. The pickles last through the year until the next mango season. One evening, while having food, Chinna Babu asked, Amma, we have so many mangoes. Make some mamidi tandra, that is am papad, from them. Their father said, Making mamidi tandra needs four weeks of hard work. If you both promise to help us every day for the next four weeks, we can together make the mamidi tandra. Both the brothers quickly agreed to help. The next day, both the children went to the market with their father. They bought a mat woven from the leaves of a palm tree, poles of kasuarina tree, string made of coconut husk, some jaggery and sugar. Page 39 Amma found a sunny place in the backyard. Both the brothers made a high platform by using poles. They spread out and tied the mat on that platform. The next day, Appa chose the most ripe mangoes. They took out the mango pulp into a large pot. Then they strained the pulp through a fine muslin cloth to remove the fibres from the pulp. Then Chitti Babu crushed the gourd, that's jaggery, till there were no lumps. They added the jaggery and sugar in equal amounts to the pulp. Page 40 Chinna Babu mixed the jaggery and sugar well with a big spoon. Amma then spread this pulp into a thin layer over the mat. The thin layer was left to dry in the sun. In the evening, they covered the mat with a clean sari to avoid any dust. The next day, they again took out some mango pulp. They added jaggery and sugar into the pulp. Then, they spread the pulp over the previous day's layer. This work was given to both the brothers. Both of them together spread many layers over it. For the next four weeks, they hoped that it would not rain. For four weeks, they added layer after layer until the jelly grew four centimetres thick and looked like a golden cake. After some days, Amma said, The Mamidi Tandra is ready. We can take it out and cut it into pieces tomorrow. The next day, the mat was brought down from the platform. Mamidi Tandra was cut into smaller pieces. The brothers tasted it. It was tasty. Chinna Babu said, Wow, how tasty! After all, we have also helped in making it. Right. Why was sugar and jaggery mixed into the mango pulp and dried in the sun? Why did Appa first choose the most ripe mangoes to be used for making the Mamidi Tandra? How did the brothers make the Mamidi Tandra? Write down step by step what they did for this. What things are made in your house from ripe, 
and unripe mangoes. Page 41 Make a list of all the different types of pickles that you know about and share with your friends. Find out and discuss. A. Is there any kind of pickle made in your house? What kind of pickle is it? Who makes it? From whom did they learn to make the pickle? B. What all things are needed to make any one type of pickle in your house? How is the pickle made? Find out the recipe and write. C. How are these things made in your house? Papad, chutney, badiya, sauce. D. It is a two-day journey by train from Pune to Kolkata. If you were to go on this trip, what food items would you carry with you? How would you pack them? Make a list on the blackboard of all the packed food. What food would you eat first? What we have learnt A. Glass jars and bottles are dried well in the sun before filling them with pickles. Why is this done? Do you remember what happened to the bread in the experiment? B. To eat mangoes round the year, we make different items like pickle, arm papad, chutney, chikki, etc. List some other food with which we make different things so that we can enjoy it throughout the year. Chapter 4 of total 22 chapters of the book Looking Around 5 ends here. Narrator Richa Sayal Producer Vimlesh Chaudhary Presented by CIET NCERT New Delhi, India